Hey everyone, Daniel Fusco here. Welcome to today's two minute message. So I wanna talk with you today about something that's not a popular topic, but it needs to be discussed because it's real and that's the reality of hell. Now, hell is wherever a person is living where they are not under the experience of God's blessing. So from the Bible, really what we find is that there are actually two versions of hell. One is on this side of eternity and the other is on the other side of eternity. See, hell on this side of eternity is you living your life outside of God's love and grace that is only found in Jesus Christ. If you're watching this and you've never put your faith and trust in Jesus, you are actually living in hell right now because you are not experiencing all that God would have for you. You might say, well, I'm having a blast, Fusco. What do you know? You might be seeming to have a blast, but what you're doing right now is only pleasurable for a season. And ultimately, you are in the process of being hollowed out spiritually and, you will, and God created you to experience him on this side of eternity. So you don't want to live hell on earth. But there is also hell in the afterlife. And that is what happens when someone rejects Jesus and are not, is not forgiven by God. And at that point when somebody dies and, they're, and they leave the body, at that point there is an eternal abode for those who have rejected Jesus that's called hell. Now some people say, well, that's a primitive belief. You can't say that it's a primitive belief because many very intelligent people believe it and you haven't been there and neither have I. But we learn about hell from the one person who knows the beginning from the end, the Alpha and the Omega, and that that is God as he is revealed in the Bible and Jesus. And hell is very, very real. And when you put your faith and trust in Jesus, God's grace and forgiveness takes you from a life that is destined for hell and puts you in the place of God's blessing. So receive Jesus and you do not have to experience hell on this side of eternity or on the other side of death, but you get to experience all that God is for you in Christ. And you want to experience that. And I want you to experience it. God bless you today.